Welcome back. You're still watching the news now on PLOS TV Africa. The motorists in Kaduna State have continued to express their dismay over the persistent fuel scarcity in the country, with many of them spending hours on long queues at filling stations before getting the product. As some of the few filling stations are selling the premium motor spirit at the official pump price, and while other fuel stations were selling at 220 to 250 to motorists. PLOS TV correspondent Habila Dorofai's report is presented from our studio. The recent fuel scarcity in the country has continued to push many Nigerians into untold hardship as it affects all aspects of the nation's economy. Some of the motorists in Kaduna State say they spend hours in long queues at most filling stations buying the fuel at a high price as most of the fuel stations are to sell at night as black market, which according to them contributes to the scarcity. It affects us on every side. It makes the, 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 the cost of food and uh, everything on a higher side. That is high inflation. And it's not going down every day. So it makes life miserable for, for us. It's not easy. Most time you buy it at 213 naira, 220 per liter. You know? So, and you, sometimes you drive a distance before you can get even the, the black market so called. So many times we made several complaints and the seller will tell us that they also buy the a black market uh, this and so well when everything becomes black market black market so where is the original there is not too much uh, profit because when you tell a passenger the price you will be angry they will not understand there is a fuel scarcity so we did not make uh, there is not any profits uh, like we normally have profits when there is fuel we find it very difficult because we sometimes we buy a black market 220 naira, 215 naira sometimes. So it's not easy for us. Some of the few stations apportion the blame to the federal government's inability to live up to its responsibilities, which according to them has continued to impose hardship on people. I am an entrepreneur and I get goods from Lagos, if I outsource, now bringing the goods to Kaduna is a chore because I pay double and then when I'm selling, I have to increase the price, which affects me because nobody wants to buy anymore with the increased price, so tedious. They therefore appeal to the APC-led administration to hasten their efforts in bringing the fuel scarcity to an end. Recall that Kaduna State government had last year banned the selling of fuel in jerry cans and gallons to individuals as black market to curb insecurity and secure the availability of the product to the residents.